you caught us. Hiya. <laughs> <laughs> so we're just getting to know each other and yeah. you just happened to find me asking him uh, what youth means to him, which is a very interesting question and I can't wait to hear his answer. However, let me just bring you up to speed real quick. My name is Valentine or at Color Me Val. It's always, always an honor to be just around you. One hour like at Y54 on Facebook, Y254 channel or Twitter, Y254 underscore channel on the ground. Hashtag of the day is why in the morning. It's a beautiful Monday. Nothing blue about it except someone's suit. Which I'm to say. Yeah. <laughs> Talk to us. Interact with us. We want to hear you. We want to see you. We want to know you. And we also... Oh, God. Wait. <clears throat> His Excellency, President William Ruto, excitedly announced 100 scholarship opportunities for Comoros students to study in Kenya. That was three days ago. A couple of weeks ago, His Excellency Rigadi Gashagwa also attended a graduation and told them, Akuna jo? Jobs. <laughs> what has your president done for you today? Yeah, good morning. Hi, guys. Hi. How are you? We're doing good. Why are you so blue, though? Uh, it's my color. Blue ah, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry. Next to me, I said, I'm going to say, I'm going to Please introduce yourself to the people. So, my name is Meshaki Protich. Mm -hmm. I'm a student leader at Zitek University. Mm -hmm. I'm interested in matters ethics, governance, and liberation politics. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm a leader well rounded. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm a secretary general of an organization called Lukamu, mm -hmm. which is determined. Uh, in uh, improving the lives of the youth mm -hmm. and uh, encouraging them to do innovations and supporting them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's me. That's Meshak. What kind of innovations? What kind of innovations? Yeah. Uh, I'll give an example. Mm -hmm. We as an organization are helping the youth. For example, in the place I'm coming from, in the university that I'm in, mm -hmm. there's a certain student who is good at making liquid soaps. Mm -hmm. But the guy has not had a platform to market his soap and... Uh, get to, 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 to earn money out of it. Mm -hmm. So us as Lukamu, we come in and uh, chip in mm -hmm. to market and to organize them mm -hmm. to have some employers so that they can supply mm -hmm. the product they have. So for Namadu? Yet to get. We'll talk about it. And you are? Okay, my name is Osundwa Chief. Mm -hmm. I'm from Ejatun University. Mm -hmm. I'm a student leader. I'm their secretary general. Mm -hmm. And uh, my passionate is about youth in leadership mm -hmm. and youth in politics. Yeah. We were just asking each other. Yeah. Uh -huh. Youth, uh, what is youth to you? Youth to me. Uh, youth to me are those young people. Young, Between young the guys. age yeah. of maybe from maybe they are 18 to maybe 35, just above 35. Your son, do you? Who are yearning maybe in leadership here, yeah. mm -hmm. young youth. Wow, if you 35, you can push. If you 36, no, no, you can 37. Kidog, kidog. 37 now, you can ancestors. 40 is the new 20. <laughs> <laughs> 35. <laughs> Be above 36 <laughs> hours on your ancestors. He did not just. Of a queen to youth. He did not just because yeah. we are telling each other where the youth of today are to eat. Yeah. And point to me a young person in mm -hmm. parliament right now. A young person. Mm -hmm. We have Linet Toto. Mm -hmm. We have Salasia. Ah, yeah. <laughs> um, what yeah. 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 We have Yeah, Pique. but you can count them with your fingers. One, two, three, four. The rest, maybe the, the, the rest are above. I think me, me too, too, maybe, but the rest are above. Do you feel like the youth are disregarded? No, not by yes, by we are. In Asuma, do not disregard yeah, the we youth. are the is in French assessed, and uh, they are more regarded in matters for more leadership, mm -hmm. and that is what is worrying me. Mm -hmm. And uh, those people, like my friend has said, mm -hmm. they are more innovative people. And they should be maybe given priorities mm -hmm. in matters governance, in mm -hmm. matters making policies in, mm -hmm. in our national politics or our national government. I have a very sensitive question I yes. want to ask you. Please remember this is not a reflection of the station's <laughs> uh, thoughts or thought process. It's just us talking. But... <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to go to the house, but I'm going to go to the house. We said we're youth, right? Mm. So, Mesh, let me start with you. 
Do you think we don't have a voice because we're not very stable as a people, as youths? Like, uh, you know, you know, like, you Mm -hmm. So by definition, maybe we don't know enough to be leading. Is that true? Uh, I think that's true because uh, the youth have not been given a platform to do what they can do best. For me, I know the youth as uh, brilliant people. This Gen Z generation, uh, the youth of this gen generation, they are good in matters leadership, innovations, mm -hmm. and, uh, and uh, content creations. Mm -hmm. The youth are best in it. Mm -hmm. And uh, I feel that the government has not given them a platform. And I'll talk most probably about uh, leadership. We have not been given a space to do uh, leadership in this country. Kuishi kwengi ndiyo kuona mengi. You have said it. But then, now, what do you want the youth to do? You're not giving them jobs. You're not giving them platform. What do you want the youth to do, basically? Mm -hmm. Do we have to be given things? Okay, as he has said. Why do you Tunisia, feel so entitled? And Tun by you, I mean you. Just, I'm not making a personal. We are not so entitled. But why? But we are, we are feeling like we are left out. Unashinda ukiomba serikali. Yeah. Utasaidia serikali lini wewe. Okay, kama serikali is to angalia. We, we had positions like CAS. Thank God they were scrapped off. Yeah, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> There is no single youth that was mm. elected in, as was appointed in those positions. Mm. Even like a ministry, let us be given even one ministry like sports. Mm -hmm. We can do better than even the, the, fa the famous words. <laughs> this, you know, you know those, those CSS in, in Ruto's cabinet, mm -hmm. you know them. We youths, we can do better than them. We know and we understand. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So when I talk to you, I'm going to No. So what? Okay. What now? I'm surprised <laughs> about and uh, uh -huh. what uh, maybe is paining me is that we we like young leaders, we have not come out so clearly, and uh, we have not yet started that conversation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And people who maybe are coming out. They are moving to the opposition side. Wanenda kupiga pale kelele, but there's no any youth who is coming out so vibrant, who is saying or who is maybe fighting for our rights. Mm -hmm. Who is saying maybe youth must be included somewhere or we must get this. Mm. So and we have started that conversation. And we will continue with that conversation. You are not going to go to Kenya. You are not going to go to Kenya. And in near future, you will be able to talk to him. You are going to go to Kenya. And the in near future. Mm. Yeah. And I want to also to oppose all these guys. Oh, oppose. Uh, the youth, we are not for Kenya. Mm. Basically, when you say Kenya, you mean Mandamano. Yes. And yes. I, I don't want the picture of the youth mm. to be. I don't want this picture of saying the youth are for mandamanos. Mm. Now, as we talk about mandamanos, I want to give you examples. Recently, during the Sabasaba mandamanos, mm -hmm. how many lives did we lost? Mm -hmm. And even before I say it, I want to pass my condolences mm. to the student who was killed in uh, Kisi County. Uh, her name is Eunice. Mm -hmm. Us as comrades, we lost, we lost one of our own because of the Sabasaba mandamanos. We have, we have lost many people in this country because of Mandamano. And I don't want this act of saying the youth are for Mandamano. We are not for Mandamano. We have, uh, we can issue out, or we can tell our issues best. It's not a must for us to go for Mandamano. Mm -hmm. Basically, that's a political move. And many people do this because of their political benefits. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the youth are not for Mandamano. Please let us kill that in the atmosphere. But as as we talk now, you have agreed that we are in Mandamano. Mm -hmm. Because nobody is coming out. You have said somebody was killed. God forbid. Yes. They were in Mandamano, right? No, 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 no. Bas okay. Oh, can you Some. tell me an example of a youth who is just just coming out, like he's not going in opposition mm -hmm. side. He's not going for Mandamano. I, I believe the youth can uh, come with a, with their own forum. It's yeah. not a must for, for us youth to, to join the opposition. Yeah, it's not, it's a, not must. a must. That is what now... We can, the, come, we, yeah. can, we, can, we can do our own, mm -hmm. you see? 
we can create our own channel mm -hmm. how we can issue our grievances what if maybe that's now the conversation i'm organized. talking about we must and, now and by the way and by the, the way before, before, before i forget out this, our views. Uh, the, the student who was killed was from kisi county mm -hmm. and the cabinet secretary for education comes from the same county mm -hmm. and he has said nothing concerning that uh, that girl and that says much on what kind of leaders we have in this country. No, actually, I'm quite concerned about the youth. Yeah. Why, if we decided to be organized, if, for example, we had a media blackout, the media is quite powerful right now. Yeah, Tech is taking is over the world, sure. is it not? This is the world we're living in. This is what we're coming into. If we decided Kilamtu Afanya Tuki to Twitter, Facebook, now there's threads. If we just all decided to shout, would not the international community see us? But no, you may not talk about the workers for your future. Upon not what, really. What we want, maybe. No, you want to be returning officers. Okay, what we want. Mushika tear gas. To not take that now platform, ille organization, ya youth, ya youth, ya youth, now we are championing for youth rights. It still has never Can you happened. just be organized yeah. about yeah. it? You yeah, don't we have, have to. We have not been organized. And, and, and that's why I'm saying, yes. I'm the, I'm, I, I personally am the Secretary General of an organization called Lukamu. Mm -hmm. This is not, it's a non-governmental uh, organization. We, we don't choose sides in the political field. We champion uh, for the things concerning youth. Also, there's a guy who started uh, the Kenya Comrade Solidarity Movement. Mm -hmm. This guy is not in government and is not in opposition. Mm -hmm. So youth come up with their own thing. It's not a must for you to, uh, to go op opposition or to government so that your issues can be heard. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You don't have to shout. You don't have to. Allah from when the parliament wants to crush like children. Yeah, nisawa. Monkey see, monkey do. That was not even part of the topic, by the way. Eh, but very nice conversation. I yes. like it <laughs> very much. Hashtag is when the morning. So, the headline today on the paper, the tenth day of July. So, it's no place for small tribes in public service. To twenty twenty three, buana. How is still being tribal? Do you think it's an issue? Uh, tribalism in, is an issue in Kenya. It, it is not a new thing. It's something that has been there mm -hmm. ever since uh, the founding fathers uh, came, came in place. Mm -hmm. And uh, right now, the way we are moving, or uh, in the next generation, mm -hmm. tribalism is not going to be an issue. Mm -hmm. uh, why are you so confident? I'm so confident because this day in juncture, mm -hmm. the youth have interacted in campuses. Mm -hmm. The youth have interacted in, in TVETs and in various f forums. Mm -hmm. People are, are having friends, not based on any community. Mm -hmm. You see? Uh, like, for example, me. I'm a leader at Zitek University, mm -hmm. right? But I don't lead only the Kalenjin because I'm a Kalenjin. Mm -hmm. I lead the whole, the whole school mm -hmm. and all students of Zetek University. Do you feel that sometimes you are privileged or maybe they sidetrack you because of who or where you come from, who you are or where you come from? Mm -hmm. Do you feel like that's, it's a disadvantage to you? It's not a disadvantage, it's an advantage because I've been given the platform to lead. Mm -hmm. And among the things that I'm champ championing for, mm -hmm. uh, uh, is the solidarity mm -hmm. of the students, mm -hmm. the oneness. Let's talk in one voice, you see? Mm -hmm. We don't have to talk because you, you are uh, you're, you're Luo, I'm Kalenjin, we don't have to, to engage. Mm -hmm. That's a wrong thing. Mm -hmm. And for us who are eyeing on the political arena mm -hmm. of Kenyan government, mm -hmm. I think that's something we must kill. Mm -hmm. Yes. How are you feeling about this, Jeff? Um, it's fine, okay, on matters tribalism, mm -hmm. Uh, it's so disheartening and uh, I want to say that it will be a very hard task mm -hmm. to end tribalism in Kenya and tribal politics. Mm -hmm. I want to disagree with my brother that in the near future it will be done away with tribalism. Mm -hmm. I can't see any true way of ending tribalism mm -hmm. because our leaders from the top they are one championing for tribalism mm -hmm. and they could not have been where they are right now because of as in without tribalism mm -hmm. yeah 
we are much into tribalism and we I don't think if maybe maybe it will be a miracle. Mm. Maybe spirits of our maybe the ancestors. Did he just say spirit? <laughs> <laughs> In the spirit, so maybe of our <laughs> leaders who maybe went uh -huh. long time ago, maybe uh -huh. we can end tribalism. But uh, right now, I don't think I don't see any through way because even in our campus politics, I'm a leader, mm -hmm. and it was the basis of maybe tribalism that now we are electing leaders. Now, that is why now you see in parliament like you have said mm -hmm. those people were throwing chairs they're incompetent mm -hmm. yeah o do you think okay this is not even a question mm -hmm. because this is something that i've seen time and time again especially during the campaigning season unapata huyu ako na stronghold mahali like huyu akishindwa hapa corruption yes. yeah corruption juini ni kwao bwana unanipata yes so really if it's stemming from the campaigning season mbona isingie yeah. mbona msimenipatie cheo si hata nikupatie jo kwanza tulisema hii kavani kuna invest watu wame invest kuna wenye invest more na kuna wenye invest less mm -hmm. can you explain what that what that means who are the investors <laughs> the government is a, is a, the, is a the investors are, are <laughs> tribes like kalenjina the kikuyu the more investors in the government mm -hmm. and we are not lying about that and, and i'll yeah. stand for my community yeah. and and you'll the, give me time to stand for my community uh, yeah. you cannot say uh, kalenjina and kikuyu have dominated the country they have dominated you see, you see, yes the top positions yeah. are looking for competent, competent at people mm -hmm. who can come and champion for the rights of Kenyans mm -hmm. and uh, what they can do to the normal Mwananchi. Mm -hmm. So if a Kikuyu or a Kalenjin is competent, then why should he not be given a chance? Is it perhaps a problem we, with you know, numbers? You know, you know in leadership... Ni jumuko wengi. No, 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 no. Leadership is treated by attitude. Uh -huh. And among the attributes, attributes of leadership uh, is uh, competency, and sacrifice to the betterment of humanity. Mm -hmm. You see? If a Kalenjin, for instance, comes to your office, mm -hmm. looks for a job, mm -hmm. and then another tribe, let's say Kamba or, or Luo, comes to your office and least, is less competent mm -hmm. to the Kalenjin, who are you going to offer the job? But my friend, here we are not talking about competency. What are you, you, are saying, about? You, you, can, you can even see what's happening. You can say, out of Ten positions, mm -hmm. like eight colors are competent. Yes, yes. Uh, yes. You, 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 it's not even logical. That Why way. is it not logical? It's very disturbing. Yeah, that it, you are a champion for the youth, but now umeata kuangalia youth, umeanza kuangalia tribe. Is there not a problem there? It's a problem. That's why I'm saying. Um, I, I started by saying I'm disheartened and I'm surprised. Mm -hmm. I don't know where we are heading to. But as by my view, that was my view about tribalism. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it will take time as a Sakenya to heal from that disease. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. So it's a problem. It's a problem. So after we've finished, say, oh, and, and, and niwa, let me niwa, tell my say, brother. Wait a minute, uh, Val. Now we're going I, I to, want to tell my brother. Now, if it's a problem, you as a leader, mm -hmm. I believe as a leader, first you have to be a decision maker. And a solution no, 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 you have to be more brilliant mm. to see the problem that people are, safe, uh, are facing and come up with solutions on how to curb the problem. So w what, what solutions do you have instead of coming on live air and, and telling us that it's a problem and then we leave it like that? That's why I said we must have leaders from the top. Especially You're the standing president. standing to you what you said. Yeah, the president. <laughs> yes. yes. Those people must have those spirits of our, maybe our forefathers, the spirit of Thomas Sankara. Uh, the spirits that they not exclude anyone in government. Mm -hmm. It will start there. It will not start by us mm. uh, how, how down we, here. What? It will start at the top. My, my brother. So the moment we elect people who are more tribalistic, it will not end any soon. No. What it's solutions do you have? You cannot come on live and yeah. telling us about spirits. Mm -hmm. How do you want the spirit of Jomo Kenyatta to come to, to Ruto? How mm -hmm. do you want the spirit of, of Moi? How do you want the spirit of... These people are dead. Yeah, hitting and, low and, blows. Uh, and uh, <laughs> uh, rest in peace to, 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 the, to the forefathers.
But uh, I want to tell my brother, the solution is not spirits. Mm -hmm. Come up with a, with a, with a, with a modern solution. What is your solution? Uh, competency. Mm -hmm. If you fit in, let you be given the opportunity. Mm -hmm. As long as you fit in, you have the required, uh, you are able to do what you want to do. Mm -hmm. Yes. Let you I'm not too sure if you're familiar with the book Animal Farm. Some people are more equal. Than, everyone is equal, but some are more equal than others. Evil tundo tunacheza hapa say. But I want us to sidestep that a little bit before time runs away from us. Yeah, so today, the verdict is about to come out for the finance bill. And, hey, me, Apple, you had me at doubling VAT, finished me, okay? And then you came in with the housing, and then suddenly, now EPRA is just doing things illegally out of their mandates. So mm -hmm. surely we cannot be at 195.53. What is that? See Sasa Ufany kwe miasa babas. Ah, increase. <laughs> annoyed. By there I'm very annoyed. And, and I can so tell that, you, that, you are, that you are very annoyed on... Uh, in any effect. Uh, <laughs> I can see it in your face. In any effect. <laughs> Scary ni one million say. Uh, eh? Ah. Ni vile tu na penanga unga ya kisi ya gives. Amesema ni. Baengi hizi vitu zingine. Amesema ni noveta. Neza tulete other means za ku. Ah, tulete food. Na si miti ni six hundred. I sure will. When I have that opportunity in the future, I will give a solution on that. Kuna other means of maybe getting us tired. <laughs> All right, so they're about to take a part. Now, what fascinated me is learning that the court can deliberate. Yes, the judiciary is a separate arm of, you know, it's by itself. Independent. Yes, there we go. Eh, by itself. Anyway, it's an, it's an independent um, situation, institution. So, as it is, it can take apart the finance bill. For example, my heart is breaking smaller as I'm saying this. But, for example, if they agreed this 3% house levy should go forth, but something else would remain. Yeah. So if they refused VAT to be doubled, maybe they would agree that Mafta Ibaki to Marina Fakubaki in Pata. So what, what do you want as a person, Kabla Twendele, what do you want to stay? Where do you want to go? What do you think is fair that it should stay? Because I can be upset all I want about tax, but that's the only way the country will grow. That's the only way we'll make money and grow as an economy. Yeah, but what do you think is really unfair about that finance bill? Mm. I've heard you, Van, and uh, it's so sad to see government institutions doing things illegally mm -hmm. and uh, like for example ipro mm -hmm. this thing has not be, been passed you see so so why it's, it's illegal i think it's illegal mm -hmm. and uh, it shows a bad picture mm -hmm. on the government and i uh, am of the opinion and i want to second you mm -hmm. that some of the things should pass some should remain mm -hmm. You know, you people focused on on the housing levy and mm. uh, and what, housing and and VAT. petroleum mm. and VAT. <coughs> but then there are many other things that the finance bill has. Mm. Like for example, money banking. Mm -hmm. Its tax was was increased from twelve to twelve to fifteen percent, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, electronic banking. Mm -hmm was left that way. And mm -hmm. yet, many people in Kenya right now are using money banking to, to do true. their transactions, you mm -hmm. see? So those are some of the things that should go back to the National Assembly for debating. Mm -hmm. though, though some people have issues concerning National Assembly, and uh, I heard last, last, last week the, mi minori the majority whip, Silvana Sosoro, talking somewhere, saying they, they had to pay uh, some MP so that they, they could not turn, turn up for the, mm -hmm. for the finance bill. And uh, those are some of the things that should go back to the National Assembly. These people should be competent enough to go debate uh, and go 
do things in favor of the normal Monainchi mm -hmm. and of the people that voted them in to go to that position. So some of the things should go back to the, to the National Assembly. Mm -hmm. Like for example, the Senate was complaining they were not involved in matters housing. <laughs> And yet it's an issue affecting even the counties, you see? Uh -huh. So it should go back. Let the Senate be given its, its honor. Meanwhile, my president is giving scholarships for yeah. people to study in Kenya. Mm. Talk to me, Jeff. It's, it's amazing. <laughs> it's wonderful, isn't it? <laughs> mm. It's amazing. And uh, I wonder if it's going to be implemented. I, maybe, maybe it's just word of mouth. Uh, because right now, nobody is sure of what my president is saying. Mm. We are not sure. Of but meanwhile, he's just always talking to the media. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Always. He's, he's always talking. Ako tu anon kea. Watoto, you know, children are so innocent and just say what they, they but, believe. But if, if that uh, scholarships mm -hmm. are going to help even the, the, the comrades of Kenya, mm -hmm. if comrades of Kenya can go to, to the other countries to go do further studies. Kama hapa hakuna kazi. Uh, uh, na watu wana struggle na school fees. Uh -huh. Vitu zimekuwa haikaliki bwana Kenya. Uh -huh. How are we going to If it's going to help uh, and I hope it is going to we wish the Jeff, the, the, the government all the best. <laughs> <laughs> talk to me Jeff. Uh -huh. finance bill. Uh I know the government you know what mwananchi wants to hear is the maybe the basic commodities mm -hmm. yeah maybe something like petrol something like kunga something like sukari that is what we want to hear mm -hmm. but now if you are bringing us uh, like house levy like you are three percent and maybe and you are saying a that is like discriminating other people in in the society like you're saying those who are working watch out to your now work or to live person you when you work move you know 97 percent how will that seven percent of kenya's population and under fifty thousand yeah three percent that he may walk at 50 they have increased or may increase in jf for me increase everything mm -hmm. and 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 i think the how is that we all money and less than 50 percent how is he and end on your money now and i want After to ask the, the courts of Kenya, taxation because it's today that they are going to say something about the finance bill mm -hmm. the court should stand firm to, to in, in the voice of the normal people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They should consider even the person earning 20,000, mm -hmm. earning 10,000. The courts should, should be able to say something today, and I really hope they are going to. Mm -hmm. I trust in the courts of Kenya, uh, and it, it showed its competency when it, it demolished the office of the CAS, CASS. And no, I, know fly, no that, story, I, I know we are coming to that. I know we are coming to that. The halls of justice have been so busy. Because, because let me tell you something, Val, ab about the CAS position. Mm -hmm. We saw their salaries. Mm -hmm. Each one of them were, were earning up to one million and something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, there were how many CASs? 50. 50. 50. 50. Additional 27 now, for no reason. 50 million, <laughs> 50 million shillings. Mm. Up to 51 because mm. of the allowances. But his These people have security. Said he needs more hands and minds. H how? How do you, Now... How are we going to pay these people using money coming from the taxpayers? And then also, we have th the same same person is increasing uh, fuel. Mbona hizo pesa tu wangi gather na eke na punguze hata iyo 16% ya fuel. Because when you, when you raise the, the percentage of fuel, everything else is going to go up. Domino effect. Definitely. Domino effect. Yeah. If fuel price increase, that means transport. That means now the food that from yeah. the farmer to come to Lazima. you is to mm -hmm. double. So, so Ata, I, I don't know now what the price of sugar is going to be because right now a kg of sugar is going for around 220 shillings. Now, now if you will, when you panda, in end of kope sangapi, we should be asking <laughs> ourselves <laughs> such <laughs> questions. <laughs> All right, I think we have to wrap this up. I, uh, uh, wow.
time flies when you're having wonderful conversations all right so so many things i wanted to say so many things we should have had conversations on but we have touched on the finance bill very important because today is the day the verdict is coming out we have talked about the splashing headline which is tribalism which i do not understand why is it still has such a thing to go to 2023 you need to, we even have a new social media platform called Threads. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tribalism. <laughs> anyway. And, and by the way, because we are on Threads, you can also follow me on Threads. <laughs> <laughs> opportunist. <laughs> you are an opportunist. Because now we are talking about Threads. <laughs> Thank you so very much for coming. Maybe if you'd like to fit in a last word before we wrap this up. Yeah, sure. Uh, I want to thank you for giving me this platform. Anytime to go live on air and uh, I want to talk on behalf mm -hmm. of the youth of Kenya. Uh, let's embrace togetherness. Mm -hmm. Let's embrace peace. We don't want to hear uh, cases of people being dying because of picketing, because of mandamanos. Mm -hmm. We don't want to hear people uh, losing, maybe people going to hospitals because they have been injured. Mm -hmm. We want a government, we, w we want a youth where we build each other. We are there for each other. Mm -hmm. uh, let's be brilliant enough to see what's happening. Mm -hmm. Let's not go support uh, political movements, mm. which are going in benefit of some other people, mm -hmm. you see? And uh, I wish all, all the youth of Kenya all the best in whatever they do, and mm -hmm. all the comrades mm -hmm. in various universities. Mm -hmm. Yes. And, and, and uh, before I finish, mm. I come from Kericho County. Mm -hmm. And uh, recently there was uh, uh, a tragic road accident yes, in Londiani. Londiani. And I want to pass my condolences to the families of the deceased. Mm -hmm. And uh, there are some comrades who have lost their parents. Mm -hmm. And right now, Kericho is sad, mm -hmm. basically. Kericho has been having issues concerning tea farms, mm -hmm. now deaths, you see. Mm -hmm. So this should speak to the ministries of this government. Mm -hmm. And uh, let something be done mm. concerning this. Mm. I don't have much. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, what I want to say, mm -hmm. I also want to, I'm passionate about youth leadership. Mm -hmm. And what I want to confirm to the all youth in Kenya that let us stand up. Okay, let us raise our voices and let us reject to be used. Mm -hmm. by maybe opposition or political leaders who want uh, self-interest for themselves. And uh, as we have talked, young leaders in the nation are so innovative, mm -hmm. they're so creative, and when they're given that op opportunity or that chance, we can do wonders mm -hmm. and we can make policies, strong policies, Mm -hmm. that will propel this uh, country to another level. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what now I want, I just want the government to also consider young people. Uh, we are so competent and given the opportunity, we can perform better. Mm -hmm. And to all comrades, please don't be used. Mm -hmm. uh, we will start now a conversation <coughs> of now peace and whatever mm -hmm. so that we avoid the early deaths mm -hmm. for our young our young leaders mm -hmm. we have lost so many souls and the souls we lost they are young leaders mm -hmm. and it's so worrying and it's so disheartening mm -hmm. yeah um, um, and it's so unfortunate that in kenya we are not only losing lives yeah, yeah. we are also burying dreams yeah we are burying brilliant dreams minds. yeah brilliant That's minds deep. yes so what I want, I want to urge young leaders and comrades who are out there, we are, we are, we are coming for you. Mm -hmm. Okay, I personally, uh, we have started a movement, a movement called Youth in Governance. Mm -hmm. So we want to educate our fellow youth on their rights mm -hmm. and also we want to create that platform that we can also be seen mm -hmm. by government so that even the competency you have talked about lies in young people. Mm -hmm. We are so competent and I know if we're given that chance, 
we can perform better. Mm. Yes. Thank you so very much, both of you. It's yeah. been an honor to host you. Mm. Oh, social media, sorry, handles. People are excited to be on thread. Yeah. Tell us. Uh, so you can find me on Instagram at Mesha Kiprotich, Twitter at Engineer Mesha Kiprotich, TikTok at Mesha Kiprotich, Facebook mm -hmm. at Mesha Kiprotich, mm -hmm. and the threads at Mesha Kiprotich. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> okay, me on Twitter at uh, Sundwa Chief, mm -hmm. uh, Instagram or Sundwa Chief, mm -hmm. Facebook at Sundwa Chief, mm -hmm. and also TikTok at Sundwa Chief, mm -hmm. even Threads at Sundwa Chief. Mm -hmm. Yes. Also, you on the Threads bandwagon. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I like that you stay. We on. have buried Twitter. Ah! Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> it's more than, it's more than alive. <laughs> wow! Oh, we are buried in Twitter. Eh. Yes. Makosa, uh -huh. Makosa. Anyway, mm. eh, these apps keep coming and going, coming and going. One day is this one, next day is that one. But anyway, I want to encourage you to never disregard your youth because this is exactly what this is meant for. It's a youth platform. Yeah, we want to talk to you and think. Don't fight. Don't allow anyone to influence you to do something you don't want to do. It's okay. At Y254 on Facebook, Y254 channel on Twitter, Y254 underscore channel on the ground. Hashtag of the day is Y in the morning. My name is Valentine. It has been my complete honor to be with you. Next, we'll be talking about some other serious things, but I think I'm done for now. See you later. <laughs>